The handle is much smaller and also the entire body here is made of alloy or steel or uh, let's call it a metal while here right here it's a plastic this is an aluminium piece but it's spongy flexy doesn't feel good key issue with Magura anti 5 brakes is if you see this plastic zip tie here so just press the brakes to the end and this, all of this plastic cover flew away and that happened one day before I was going to Hafiel bike park in Norway. I, I got an advice from other riders in, and the mechanic in the workshop also confirmed that he had seen this modification many many times already. So I'm not the first one losing that part. As Magura didn't reply to my email for 4 weeks and no one around two bike parks in Norway had any parts related to Magura I had to replace it with SLX and as I done it more than a month ago and ridden bike every day after that today I decided to switch my front lever to SLX as well first step is you need to take off this little cover step 2 is unscrew this bolt with 7mm wrench you will need to replace this part as it won't fit the Shimano brake on the left side Magura, on the right side Shimano and I will need to cut the hose. Step 4. Cut the hose. This thing. Put it on the hose. Slide it all the way in. And to do so, you can actually use a tool, which will be provided in your bleed kit. And then simply tap it with a rubber hammer or something like that. Step 5. Remove the plastic handle. Alright, what I suggest right now is not to put the, the brake handle on the handlebar before you add this in. And the reason is when uh, turning this screw in or end cap or whatever you call it, it might twist the cable a little bit so uh, I will have freedom to rotate the, the handle if I want. So what do you do next? You take a little, little oil, olive. I put it uh, just right here. And then I uh, put it inside my brake handle and then you need to squeeze it. And this is why these tools just suck. Because you round the corners and you need a normal 7mm wrench. Next step is to put your handle on the handlebar. And the last thing to do right now is to bleed the brakes. I've been mixing royal blood from Magura and Shimano mineral oil now for several months and they both work fine. We can add the end cap now. And it's done. Let's go for a test ride. All right. So let's let's see how the brakes operate. Oh my god. So the handle feels really nice. So my first thoughts are very positive. I really like the way the handles operate. You can feel where is the locking point and the uh, not spongy at all. So now I can finally modulate my brake and choose if I want to block it or if I want to just press it. It feels so much better just after first seconds of ride compared to Magura MT5 handles. And of course keeping the Magura cylinder. So Shigura all the way. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did give it a thumbs up if you hated it give it a thumbs down subscribe to see more and i see you in the next one